Okay, how much money have you spent on that game, do you think? Bro, I don't Or do you like, oh. do you not even want to think about it? Listen. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Guest House. It's Chrissy Costanza, and today we're going to be doing some first and last anime edition with, of course, our resident anime expert, Emily Ghoul. She's in the Guest House right now. What's up, Emily? Hello! Hi, friend! It's so glad to be back. I love being in here, except for it's freezing. I had a really cute outfit on under this, but here I am with this big jacket, but... <laughs> <laughs> I like the jacket. It's yeah. fun. It's a fun color. Red's my favorite color. Oh, red is my um, favorite color. So we're color. gonna be doing first and last anime edition, and you are an anime expert, and you've seen so many animes. And I know we were talking about this a little bit before. I wonder if some of these questions are gonna be a little difficult, just because you've seen so many. Trying to think of some of these first and lasts are gonna be uh, maybe challenging. All right, let's get right into the first one. Ready? Ready. First anime TV series you watched. So hard. Um, I think I yeah. would say it was either the, either Naruto or D Gray Man. But I want to talk about D Gray Man because I feel like everyone knows what Naruto is. Um, D Gray Man's really dope. Um, it's basically about this evil guy who can turn people's souls, like dead people's souls, into um, demons. So there's this guy called Alan Walker and he goes around like exercising them, not like at the gym, but like yeah. getting rid of <laughs> I always have to say that because every time I think of exercising, not exercising, <laughs> not with the dumbbells, but with the blades. Um, yeah, so it's, it's really dope. It's really long. It's actually one of my favorite anime still. So I really yeah. love it. So you should t check out D Gray Man if you have time. D Gray Man. And last one that you've seen? Most My recent, most recent one was, <laughs> it's actually kind of funny. Um, there's an anime, I I've been in watching like daily life animes now and there's one called Rent a Girlfriend. I love that. See, you would think that it's something weird, but it's actually really, really cute. Um, Rent a Girlfriend is actually super fun. So if you're into the kind of like um, daily life, it's about a boy who gets broken up with and he's really, really sad. He's like, I know he's like really awkward and shy. So he goes on this app where you can yeah. rent a girlfriend for a day, right? And he starts to fall in love with this girl. And she's oh, so I love it's that so for cute. Him. I know. So you should check that out too. It's really, really fun. Yeah. Okay. okay. Anime movie you watched first and last. First. Pokemon? I mean, I was like probably like 10. That counts? Right. That, was that counts. I'm going to say that's probably one of the first anime movies I've watched was probably. And what about last? Last. Um, you know what? I don't really watch the movies. Um, Your Name? I would say. Cool. Works for us. All right, first and last show you suggested to a friend. First, probably Naruto. And last, uh, Jujutsu Kaisen. All right, first and last anime character you crushed on. First. First ever was from, I think, a manga. I would say it's um, Daisuke from D and Angel. Super random. Yeah, he turns into like a phantom thief at night super hot uh wait does his meet his name just mean like i like you yeah it means i like you isn't that <laughs> so cute yeah i like that's really yeah. cute <laughs> and last one last um boy that i crushed on <sighs> probably gojo sensei from jujutsu kaisen is probably my most recent crush my first and last is Lelouch. He's it for me. That's really? all I need Your in life. Really? first and last? Oh, see, that's what I thought, too. And then you meet so many other bad boys, and it's really hard. We love them bad anime boys. Why that character from Jujutsu? Um, you know, I think I have a thing for the, the white-haired anime characters and, he, the, and the senseis. Um, so he is super strong, <laughs> and he's sarcastically funny and kind of yeah. dorky. But then, you know those ca characters that are dorky, and then they get super serious when they fight? He's one, oh, he's one of those. Oh, yeah. He's one of those. So he turns on that, that like that beast mode, yeah, and then so you're he's just like, like hee, 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 and then... I love that. Yeah. All right, anime world you'd live in, first and last. <gasps> so the first one you got like really into, and then the most recent one. That's really hard because I don't really want to live in any of these places. Like, do I want to be in? Uh, do I want to be in Attack on Titan? Definitely not. Do I love it? Yes. <sighs> I think the first one I wanted to be in was Fruits Basket, simply because she got like 
it's like a reverse harem. <laughs> so it's like the main character is this girl and she's got like a bunch of Zodiac character boys who are like pretty much obsessed with her and they're really hot. So that's probably the first one I want to be in, Fruits Basket. The last one I wanted to be in, if I'm like super, super strong, I think I want to be in Hunter Hunter just Ooh, because I want to be a okay. hunter. Yeah. I love that. All right. Anime figure you purchased first of last. Anime figure I purchased. My last. You have like a treasure. Trove. I have a huge treasure. Oh my gosh, <laughs> this is so difficult. I think my first ever probably was one of my Naruto figures. I can't remember which one. I have like 15 of them. And my last one that I purchased was. Wow, I'm like really racking my brain because I buy them in bunches. Um, I would have to say. I got an Attack on Titan one. I think would be my most recent one. I got an Attack on Titan one. I got a Levi one. Okay, yeah. what about the first and last time you cried while watching an anime? First time was Pokemon. That one scene when Pikachu was like laying down. You know, do you, I feel like it's such an iconic scene. I can't say if it was from one of the movies or one of the episodes, but it was when Pikachu was like laying down. He was like, eh, and he was like dying definitely cried there. The last one I cried was this anime called Given. Super beautiful. Cried at the end, so that was really good. Yeah. Okay, first and last anime soundtrack you listen to. Oh my gosh. Um, first anime soundtrack? Yeah. Yeah, it was no, it was definitely Pokemon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was like 10. And what about most recently? Right? Most recent was also Given. I listened to the whole soundtrack from Given. Yeah. All right. What about the first and last anime cosplay you wore? First, my first cosplay was actually a game cosplay. Like my first legit cosplay was a, I did D.Va. Um, for my first legit oh, cosplay. Oh, I love Yes, that. I did D.Va. Um, not an anime, but it was my first cosplay. My first yeah. anime cosplay was probably Asuna from Sword Art Online. I did the whole armor, the whole shebang. And my last character that I cosplayed, I actually did um, a Jujutsu Kaisen Sukuna transformation. Yeah. So I think that counts, but a first, like a real cosplay was also a game actually. I did Sage from Valorant. Not an anime yeah, again, it was epic. but super like legit. So yeah. Okay, first and last Studio Ghibli film you saw. <gasps> That's so difficult. Which one was the first? I, oh, the first one was um, 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 Spirited Away. Spirited Away, uh, okay. I think what I think was my first one, and the last one that I saw, I actually recently was rewatching them with my friends. So my neighbor Totoro, yeah. All right, what about the first and last manga you read? First manga was D and Angel. Last one was God of High School. And then last question: first and last anime game you played? Oh, first Pokemon first game. Uh, last game, does Genshin Impact count? Yeah, 100%. Fire, that's what I've been, I've been grinding Genshin Impact. So I think I'm adventure rank 51 now and my characters are all like 80, at like level how 80. Much, yeah. Okay, how much money have you spent on that game, do you think? Bro, I don't Or do you like, know. do you not even want to think about it? <laughs> Listen, so you know how when you go on your credit card, you can check um, like what you spent on? So there was like a yeah. section called entertainment and I was like, I don't do anything entertaining. Why is there so much money spent here? Like, and I it's a pandemic. It. I'm not going to a movie theater. So that's what I said, right? And I checked it and it was like all from Genshin Impact. And I'm just gonna say they were in the hundreds each transaction. So oh. I know, oh. I know. Cause you don't think you're spending that much money, but then you look and you're like, wow, that was all in one month. I'm disgusting. All right, that was first and last anime edition with Emily Gould, our resident anime expert. Make sure you leave your first and last in the comments below and also let us know who you want us to have next on for some first and last action. Thanks so much.